mejor puta ah, que he chingado. Ah, ¡Viva México! Ay, oh, ah, ¡Qué rico! Ah, 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 John, excuse me. Ah, oye, mamita, cuando te vea la próxima vez, que sea un poco más durito, ¿eh? And I mean rougher, ¿eh? What would your most loyal follower, Luisa, say about that? Who? Luisa, the girl from Camp Omerada. Uh, all right. A gentleman never tells, but she was a most wonderful... Uh, I just say she was incredible. Yes. Let me tell you something. I strongly recommend her. You take her when you have the chance, my brother. She thinks she's your wife. My wife? These peasant girls, they believe every word a fellow says. So naive. It's really quite charming. I love peasants. Don't you love peasants? I love them. They have such purity. Are you gonna marry her? Ha! Marry a peasant? My dear boy, don't be absurd. I'm going to be the next president of Mexico. My wife will meet ambassadors, kings, other great men. The very thought that I would marry some peasant girl with a tight gun and the hands of a farmer. Well, I really don't think so. My mother, que Dios la cuide, would turn in her grave. Interesting. Mm -hmm. But come on, let's run. I've got an amazing present for you, my brother, huh? Yes, the man you seek. Together, we will bring them to justice. Let's go. <laughs> Titties in my face, but she was crap. She had them rolls. Her rolls had rolls. Oh, damn. And this dude right here, he just was just straight doing that, though. And she said something about Mexico. Mm. Kitties? Don't ever have sex with these crackhead women. I don't know why they made the, the ladies in this game look so ugly. Especially the Mexican women. That's kind of that's messed up. I was cracking up. It's my. <laughs> I said she had his nice teeth. Somebody said she looked like a crackhead. I was rolling. Man, sometimes our comment section be having me finished. But this is episode two for today. Welcome back to some Red Dead. Getting ready to do something now. Let's see what they're talking about. It's kind of messed up. He tricked that girl like that. My men will launch a ruse attack on the side entrance to the fort. Meanwhile, you, my American friend, will drive this wagon at the front gate and jump off with your clothes. It's been packed with five crates of TNT. That sounds crazy. How long's the fuse? <laughs> yes, like I say, fun times. It's plenty long enough, I think. I see you in there, amigo. Go on, John. You can do this. Oh my... Are you serious? I gotta... Oh, this is like some Grand Theft Auto stuff. We're gonna crash this into the gates of greatness. Jump off! I should have died right there. I jumped out too late. Did I die? Did I, did I make it out of here alive or did I die? A painful blown the fuck up death. Come on, man. Load, yo. We're playing a load. Load! I don't know what's up with this guy. For real, man. This PS3 is kind of crazy. And I just finished Kingdom Hearts 1 again. Oh, my. I still love that series. Can't wait for Kingdom Hearts 3. So I'm actually moving on to Kingdom Hearts 2. I put a couple of those gameplays up on my main channel. Not a full walkthrough, but just I might, you know, show a video or two. Because there are some games where I just play. You ain't the first army up, boy. Okay. How? How? Leave that army to ah, huh? There's a dude up there. How you doing over here, my brother? I think I might have missed his head, actually. Nah, I want to go to the Henry Repeater. Find that square before he escapes. My Who's this? Uh, they got some hardcore women out here. 
I get shot one more time, it's a wrap. Oh, this thing is nice. Oh, you want it? Should I go shotgun? Woo! What you know about getting that shotgun to the vice? Ooh. You mean to tell me he survived that? Are you kidding me? You didn't survive that. See, man, we need some more gore in these Call of Duty games, man. Ears and stuff should be coming out. Come on, buddy. All right, somebody finally got that guy. He's done. We don't even know what you're fighting for. I didn't even realize you didn't have to wait for the um the dead out of stop before you can start shooting again. So I'm gonna see. I'm gonna kill these two guys, right? But I can keep shooting. I didn't know that. There's a reason I'm the man. I'm the, I'm the muckin' man. Whoa! Oh my goodness, bitch! You try to sneak up on the wrong one. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, I was kind of scared though. I ain't, I, didn't, I looked right there. I didn't even see that guy. I don't know where he came from. Now, is it me or was I? Oh, God. <laughs> already over here. Look at the range on this shotgun. Y'all see this shit? There's no reason. Oh, yes. Yes. You will not survive that shotgun blast that close. Oh, where you thought? Look at his leg. Look at his little feet leg. Oh, damn. I know you're here, old friend. Did you see his little feet and his legs? Are you kidding me? I've come for you. He's not in here. I know he's not in here. This is our first. I said first. I meant to say first. Things are about to get really messy. Okay, I can't use this right here. So he, we know he's not in there. All right, so let's go ahead and get down. Oh, get down, get down, get down. I don't know how long this episode is going to be. Let's get on outside. Alright, on to the next tower, which is. Look at you. Oh! Ow! Mm. Alright. I just want to talk. Hello, old friend. It's been a long time. Hey. Hello, brother. It's uh, good to see you. I heard you was coming. You took your time, no? Come on, you're not gonna shoot your own brother, are you? We was family. Yeah, we were. Then you and Dutch went crazy and family didn't mean so much. <laughs> so now you do the government's work. And what do you do? You just work for a different government. <laughs> Come on, brother. I think we should go our separate ways, huh? What you and Dutch did was wrong. And the way you left me was wrong. Now, I hate to judge, but as it turns out, it's you or me. The way I see it, might as well be you. We thought you was dead, brother. I promise. I'm telling the truth. Besides, I can give you a bill. In Dutch, Dutch is in Colombia. I can take you straight to him. Hmm? You left me to die whoa. to save your own skin, and now <laughs> you expect me to care whoa, about whoa. you? You got it all wrong, brother. I've always loved you, even now. You never won. You got it this time. Okay. Hog Tower, kill him. What do y'all think we should do? Hogtown. Come on, horsey. Come on, horsey. Come on, horsey. Where the hell is my horse at? Why is it all the way over here? Are you kidding me? Oh, there he is, my beauty. 
Come on, hey man, stop moving and let me. Yeah. Did you see that horse still moving? I hope my horse is. Whoa, yeah, that's him right around the corner. My horse is too fast for you, buddy. Little closer. I just want Williams and Javier. Can we reach her from here? It's over, old friend. I got you now. Bring your monkey ass. Bring your monkey ass. Come on. I'm a man of honor, so I won't kill you right now. I'm taking you in, my brother. I'll let the others judge you. Where's Bill? I don't Where's know. Bill, you son of a bitch? Do you think I won't kill you, brother? He ain't here, brother. He's with agenda. Well, that's what you get. You he gonna put he gonna push a box on me and then ride out? What? <laughs> I ain't here to kill you, Javier. Oh wait, this is wrong Bill. horse. We gonna put the, him on my horse. And what's crazy is ain't go. nobody coming Abigail for you, buddy. Want this. Abigail would have killed you already. She always thought you was a creep. All right, let us go. Let's get our gun out just in case somebody want to get. Brother, you and me, like Cain and Abel, I guess, leaving each other for dead. That's crazy. Imagine you being um, captured and you have to ride on the back of a horse like that. Whatever you say, old friend. That ain't no way to treat people right there. Look at that, boy. I think we almost set the spot right around the corner here. My chin is itching like heck. Not me. Yeah, and he's next. Put him in the cell for now, young. You're gonna be locked up for a hell of a long time, unless they choose to hang you. All right, my chum. Oh, shit. Don't be sure about what you're doing, brother. You saw me out. Didn't that life we had mean nothing to you? Oh, ah, oh, you puto. Oh, one day, one day I promise you, you're gonna regret this. One day's about all you got left. Oh, I hope you and your wife and children rot in hell. You know that life we lived is over. And when we was living it, it didn't mean nothing anyway. It was just an excuse, and we all knew. What I knew is that you was always a puto. And you're still a puto. Marston, come with me. The army sent reinforcements. Come. Yeah, go with your puto. 